Well, folks, it's a cold morning here in Georgia, 11 degrees. So I decided it's cleanup time. I got something, I don't know if you ever tried it, but this here is called a, it's a commercial power duster with a sprayer. And uh, works pretty good as long as you don't shake it up. So I've been sitting here working on all these it's not all my locomotives, but this is a good bit of them that I had on another table. So, I sort of try to put them together, my E8s and 9s and my miscellaneous, I guess you would say, uh, locomotives. Like I said, this is just a smidgen of them <laughs> here. I got a lot of Union Pacific. I want to get some more KCS, a lot of CP rail. But you see for yourself, that stuff, uh, it does pretty good. You spray it and it, uh, and it does uh, just get all the dust off of it there and Sometimes it's hard to get to some of those places in there with the uh, with the uh, railings. These railings are very delicate on some of these. Some of them don't even have any railings, but you see my SD40-2 assortment there. And a lot of uh, GP38s. In there a lot of Norfolk and Southern Ellen in Burlington this one here is an old uh, old seaboard it doesn't the motor burn up in it that thing is 45 years old come on the store is 45 and it was running till I left it unattended and got sitting there and got hot and burnt the motor up but my fault that's your GP20s, your Sioux and your Southern, Union Pacific, GP38, your Illinois Central, Operation Lifesaver. Like I said, I've got uh, quite an assortment there. Richmond, Fredericksburg, Potomac, Wabash, the Milwaukee Road, and my southern, that's a Rapido. Proud of that thing. That's a not, a not a cheap locomotive there. And some of these are like this is no Bachman, but it's a, like a SD50, but it's a, it's a dummy now. And these Chessies, they're as old as my 45 year old daughter. I've had them since she was born when I started collecting trains. And uh, also have a uh, Athern Southern that, that I've had for years and it still runs. It's 45 years old. Check out my DD40 there along with the Union Pacific Steam. My new switcher I picked up. Actually, it was a new switcher, but it's uh, made by Tyco. And so I've got some, some pretty nice switch engines there. That's a Broadway Limited Southern Santa Fe dummy. And a Monan. Like I said, some of these don't even... As a Pennsylvania, don't even have rails on them, and I've got a lot of uh, eat. They call it uh, not you. I used to call it U bolts in there. And this one here is a is a two axle. Which you didn't see many of those. Santa Fe was the only one in Union Pacific had a few of those two axle uh, 
locomotives. They still have some working, I think, on some short lines. And then common, you'll see all these here all the time. This is, it's, I've still got some more of those. I haven't got out there. And my brand new 630 that I got for Christmas. The old KCS, Canadian Pacific. And that's a Bachman there. But anyway, um, this is just uh, part of my collection. I've got to make some more shelving. And like I said, it's a lot of a lot of trouble keeping them keeping the dust off of these if you can't run them all at once. So see what you think about it, uh, using that, I guess it's a computer spray cleaner that my wife found for me at the office store where she works. And um, see if you enjoy looking at some of my locomotives here today. Stay warm.